Man. Hey there, welcome to another weekend edition of Two Wheeled Wednesdays. Today we're going to do a bit of, well, let's back up. It's mid-October and the 2024 cycling competition season is over, well, for me at least. And uh, it's time to start thinking about and planning for 2025. Someone once said that if you want to be as fast as the devil next spring, you need to train like hell this fall and winter. I'm pretty sure that someone was me. <laughs> so I'm starting on a 16 week base strength and flexibility program to build a foundation over the next four months in preparation for speed and power specific training leading up to the first races in the spring. And that brings us back to today. Uh, today I'm gonna do a 20 minute test, as they say, to determine uh, heart rate and power levels that I can use as standards on which to base my training over the coming 16 weeks, over the next four months. It's going to be brutal. <laughs> After a 30 minute warm up, it's a full gas, 110%, drain the tank, all out effort for 20 grueling, painful minutes. It's going to hurt. All right then, it's a gorgeous day. It's perfect for a 20 minute suffer fest. Sunny, not a cloud in the sky, not too much wind. Um, and you know, I'm not getting any younger. So let's hit it. Okay, that was the warm up. The warm up itself was pretty hard. Let's let's do it.
Man. Oh, man, well, that was brutal. I'm sure my numbers would make a real bike racer laugh. I mean, I don't think I've ever gotten over 500 watts, and I don't think I got over 500 watts today. But you look at some of these pros, and they're doing, you know, eight, nine hundred, just cruising for hours at a time. They're hitting. 1500, 1800 watts in sprints. <laughs> I can't imagine that. But for a 67 year old guy who spends the majority of his time sitting at a desk, pounding on a keyboard, my numbers should be okay. Regardless of what the numbers are, at least they can give me something to work from and to base my workouts on. Sorry, I'm a little out of breath at the moment. I just hope in 16 weeks when we do this again, and I'm really looking forward to that, <laughs> that those numbers haven't dropped. That would be, that would be disappointing. Okay, that's it for this two-wheeled Wednesday on the weekend or whatever clever name I'm calling it this week. We'll see you in the next one. Cheers.